welcome to Pretty Plump and Trying. My name is Amanda. If you're new to this channel, hit the subscribe button below. If you're interested in beauty, plus size fashion, unboxings, and more, today I have my Julia's Place Valentine's Day Mystery Box. I figured I would jump on here real quick, show you guys what I got, and hopefully you enjoy. Really quick, I did use the Caliente palette today. Um, I did get this from one of my BoxyCharms. It is the only thing I'm using on my eyes. And yeah, it was nice. Um, uh, some of the shades were a bit powdery, but other than that, this look has been on for over six hours and still not bad. Still quite happy with it. So just figured I would give you guys a little heads up and let's get to the box. So the first thing I got in the box is a lip gloss and this is Disco Fever. I'll show you the packaging. I do love their packaging. And I'll show you what the lip gloss looks like. Here's what the lip gloss looks like. Let's see if we can give you some information on the lip gloss. It says that this is lightweight, non-tacky, long-lasting, and high shine. This is cruelty-free and should last about 12 months. So, really cute. I'm excited to try their lip gloss formula. And hopefully it does what it says. So, let you guys know. The next thing I got is a highlighter brush. I'll show you what this looks like. It's cute. Never gonna be mad at a brush and it feels pretty soft so I'm excited and again I'll let you guys know how it is or when I'm using it so you guys will find out. The next thing I got is a lip liner and this is in the shade Scorpio. I'll show you what it looks like. It looks like it's gonna be a nice kind of dark reddy brown kind of auburn color so that'll be pretty. Let's see. I think I might end up giving this to my sister, but hopefully you guys can see it. It's definitely going to be a darker shade, but it looks nice. We'll see. If I do use anything like that, I will let you guys know either in the description or just tell you in the video. The final thing I got is the Queen palette, and it looks like this is a collab with a lifestyle blogger and model. It looks like her name is Fumi. Um, it does have her last name on here too, but I do not want to butcher it because I already have a feeling I messed up her first name. <laughs> so I'm not trying to do that to anybody, but here's the packaging. And it says that it is a multifunctional palette with six high pigment shades. So I'll show you what it looks like. And here it is. It's really actually, um, it's cute. I will definitely be able to use this as an eyeshadow palette. I think I might be able to get away with at least one or two shades as blush. Maybe. We will see. This might be a really nice highlighter. But overall, I mean, these are... I mean, can turn my head. <laughs> these are pretty big, so I'm, I'm excited to use this and try it out. And I was thinking about maybe doing like a Valentine's Day kind of look. So this might be a really good palette to, to try out and to see because there's definitely some shades that I can play around with for a cute Valentine's Day look. So... We'll see. I'm definitely thinking about it. It might be my next video. Maybe. <laughs> but there we go. That was the mystery box. This was $15, just in case I didn't state it. And uh, yeah, not bad. Four full size products for $15 bucks is definitely um, a good value to me. So just a quick reminder that you are beautiful, lovely, and you're special. And if today is not a good day, that's okay. All I can do is try. I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.